today I'm launching a brand new platform that will contain all my app development tutorials under one roof. And I'm very excited about this because when I started coding with Flutter in 2018, I had no idea about video production and I didn't know if anyone would like my content. Fast forward two years and my channel has recently surpassed 10,000 subscribers and I produced 40 videos all about Flutter development. And beyond that, I have been sharing articles on Medium and these have also been very popular. And I've even launched my Flutter and Firebase course that now has more than 2,000 students and very high reviews. So I'd like to say a big thanks for all your support. This is what keeps me going and I can't wait to bring you more tutorials in 2020. And since we are starting a new year, there is no better time to introduce you to my new website, which is called codewithandrea.com. I have created this site to bring all my tutorials under one roof so that you can more easily browse my content. And I built this site entirely from scratch using some tools for static site generation in Swift. These have been recently open sourced by John Sandel and I want to acknowledge his amazing work because this website would not exist without it. The end result is a new responsive website that is fast, free for everyone and doesn't use any JavaScript. And these are very rare qualities on the internet these days and I hope you enjoyed the experience. By the way, coding with Flutter, which was my old website, is now dead. Or to be more accurate, it redirects to codewithandrea.com. And you may wonder why the name changed. Well, don't get me wrong. My goal for the future is to continue making high quality Flutter tutorials. But there is more. Beyond Flutter, my tutorials come from years of experience as a professional software engineer, so I want to share my knowledge and help you write effective code and become more productive. Under this light, I feel that codewithandrea.com is a new brand that will build on the strengths of coding with Flutter, and it also opens up the scope for additional tutorials that are complementary to Flutter and look more widely at mobile app development and beyond. So if you look around, you'll find all the Flutter videos and tutorials that I've already published up until now. And by the way, I've already started adding transcripts to my videos so that you can view my content in written format. And because the website supports tags, you can more easily browse the content by topic. And you can even view all the tags in one page so that you can more easily find the content you want. By the way, I've added syntax highlighting for code blocks and I'm planning to improve the highlighter to make it more accurate for Dart code. And I also want to mention that the site contains a landing page for my Flutter course and any other courses that I will publish in the future. So this means that you can always find my latest promotions over here and buying the course through this link is the best way to support my work. So this is codewithandrea.com, but this is just the beginning. The site is still missing some features and needs some tweaks and polish. And in fact, if you find something that is not working, you can report it by selecting this link at the bottom of each page. And this will take you to this repository where you can file any issues. And also you can take a look at my complete roadmap. So in the coming weeks, I'm planning to add a lot of additional features that will make this website an even better place to learn. But for now, I want to point out that the site is already quite fast and I'll continue to improve performance and accessibility as time goes and strong privacy is also built in. Apart from the embedded YouTube videos, the site itself doesn't have any client ads or trackers, not even for analytics. In fact, the whole site is JavaScript free. And to me, this is how the web should be, fast and private. Okay, so this completes the overview of my new website. So what are my plans for the future? Well, I will continue to improve the website, but I'll start again making videos for my channel, which will also be renamed to Code with Andrea. So I encourage you to go ahead and subscribe for more Flutter tutorials, and I hope that you will enjoy my new website. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you on the next video.